Hey everyone, so today I've done this celebrity inspired makeup look which I'm obsessed with. It's inspired by the amazing and beautiful Selena Gomez. She had this look done for her in, back in June, but I've been obsessed with it ever since. Apparently it only took her makeup artist 15 minutes to do. God, it took me like an hour and a half. I could not do this in 15 minutes. So if you want to see how I created this absolutely amazing bold makeup look, keep on watching. So this is the picture I'm basing my makeup look off and let's get started. As you can see, I'm just using a little bit of concealer to make sure my eye area is nice and even ready for the eyeshadow. I'm just blending that out and then I'm going to set it with face powder. So I'm taking this NYX pencil and putting that on my eyelid and then I'm smudging it out and slowly building it up to the shape, to the shape I wanted and the colour intensity. I ended up using a brush to carve out the shape to make it a lot easier to fill in later. As you can see, I'm using this Essence shadow, but I ended up switching to my Urban Decay Naked 2 palette and using the black from it. I'm doing this to make sure the pencil is set and to make it a little bit more smudgy and smoky than Selena's look. So I'm just sharpening up the line because I went a little bit crazy and then I'm using a clean blending brush to just smooth out the edges. I'm now taking my primer and priming my skin ready for the foundation. For foundation, I'm using my Smashbox Studio Skin Hydrating Foundation. I'm just dotting that over my face and then blending it out with a flat top brush. This one's by EXO Beauty. I'm using these same concealer as earlier to conceal my under eyes and then to highlight my face so I just put some on my forehead, down the bridge of my nose and my cupid's bow and on my chin and I blended it out with that same eco tool sponge. So it'll come as no surprise, but I'm using the same powder I always use, the Essence All About Matte Powder, to bake under my eyes. And while it bakes, I'm using the e.l.f. Brow Cream in Light Brown and an Eyebrow Groomer Brush by EXO Beauty to fill my eyebrows in. So I'm just using the Essence Make Me Brow to set my brows down, and then I'm going to use all of the excess powder under my eyes to set the rest of my foundation. So I'm now going back to my lower lash line and I'm using that same NYX pencil, smudging it out and joining it to the upper lid and then just making sure the intensity's good and the shape's good and making sure everything's set down. To contour, I'm using this NYX contour kit and the two middle colours on the bottom row and an EXO Beauty bronzer brush to carve out my cheekbones. So from the Benefit Cheek Parade palette, I'm using Hoola and Hoola Light to bronze my face and to also blend out that contour. So I'm going back in with that Essence powder to clean up my contour and make sure that part of my face is nice and crisp. And then using California blush to pink up my cheeks and using a banana powder to clean up under my eyes to counter out the black. So I'm just cleaning up my brow bone and then using Mary Lou to highlight all the high points of my face. So I'm just going to take a big powder brush and make sure all my face powders are blended together and then I'm going to use the Socialize I Work Up Like This Lashes on my eye. So after curling my lashes I'm using the Maybelline Colossal Big Shot Mascara to make sure my natural lashes are blended with the falsies. I'm doing both top and bottom lashes. 
To finish off the eyes, I'm just going back in with Mary Lou to highlight my inner corner and my brow bone. And on my lips is Kylie's Velvet Liquid Lipstick in Naked. So I hope you enjoyed today's video. If you did, don't forget to thumbs up. Leave a comment down below of any other video ideas you want to see. Or answer the question, which will be, what's your favourite celebrity makeup look ever? I have no idea which what mine is, but this is definitely off there. So I hope you enjoyed, and don't forget to subscribe. It's either in this corner, or in this corner, or it's down below. And I will see you guys next time. Bye!